Yeah, well, g'day everyone. Welcome back to Was It Half Triple Eight. Um, don't know if I've already said that or not. I'm doing things a bit backwards these days, but that's alright. Doesn't matter. It's all getting filmed. Um, so what we've done today is we've cleaned up the flat side through a uh, piece um, as best as I can. Um, uh, I don't know how it's going to turn out, but we just threw some satin black on it um, in a primer paint type thing, so it's all, all in one. Uh, as I said, this isn't going to be a showpiece, I just want to get it neat and tidy and put back together and, and that'll be it, it'll never get used. So we threw some satin black on that, uh, I do have a little run on there, but we might sand it off um, and recoat it. Uh, and that's pretty much all I've done this week on, on the um, utility. Um, time's a bit of an issue, uh, we've uh, been absolutely flat strapped this weekend, so I've had about an hour, uh, or an hour and a half or whatever, to, uh, to do something in the shed today. But, um, We'll see where we go next weekend. We've got nothing else planned next weekend. Uh, I do have to start painting inside, but we'll see. Um, I might get a bit of time to spend in the shed here. So uh, there we go, quick one. Um, and just to add to this, uh, and the ever increasing number of lawnmowers, here's a couple of pics of the new, few new additions that uh, some boys from work um, picked up on their way back from a job that was sitting on the side of the road. They went and saw the people and. Uh, she said, no, no, I'm getting a professional lawnmower guy to come in. I don't want these anymore. So they were just dumped on the on the highway. Uh, so the boys picked them up for me and brought them home. And a um, couple of beauties. Uh, I, I like the pace. Uh, not too good on the fly, mate, but uh, you never know. They might clean up. Might be able to sell that off. Um, and it's not make out of these. I'll just put back into the, the build funds. Um, but it'd be a shame to sell that pace. I reckon that's a classic. So... Anyway, have a look at those uh, pictures at the end here. So thanks again for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe and comment. Uh, and tell everyone about this silly old bugger. Um, and if it's stupid videos on lawnmowers and etc. So uh, thanks again. And um, yeah, we'll see what happens next week. We might even have some more additions. So I'm now up to seven lawnmowers. So this is definitely an addiction. Um, thanks again. And stick around. Bye for now. Plan of attack, if you can see it. I've got to knock that pin out because I want to take this off. Um, don't think I've got a pin punch small enough, so here's a pop rivet. And that isn't done. Either. You have days when you think, why am I bothering? Um, this is one of them. But anyway, st stick with it. That might work. Might not. Maybe, maybe not. I'm guessing not. I do really want to get that out, but I don't think it comes out. I'm guessing that's welded in there. Can that? Just try and clean up my this. See how it goes.
But it's got like um, nearly 40 years of bloody build up and shit on it, so <laughs> I don't know if I can't get that out of it. I think we'll try with a flappy disc, I think, outside and um, see how that goes. Stick around, hang on. That seems to be working a bit. I'll take it outside and we'll give it a spin, but uh, I won't film that. <laughs> Catch us in. Entry ho. Um, yeah, that's given it a bit of a, a bit of a key, so we can throw some paint on that. Um, it's still a bit rough, but yeah, it's just pitted with rust and stuff. So if I've grown too much out. There'll be nothing left. All right, we'll set it up and try and slap some paint on. See how we go. Alrighty, makeshift spray booth. They're just going to give us a few little coats. Dust it on. Which is the um, side throw flat, etc. And a satin black, we'll see how that turns out. And we're still with the deck. Top side only, I haven't done underneath yet. Don't know if you can see it there, it's still grotty, but. Um, anyway, so that's a couple of bits we got done already. Time is an issue, which I'll go through in a minute. So. Right, oh, um, look, paint's all dry. I don't know if you remember what this looked like. This was pretty shitty. Um, but I think it's come up alright. It's a bit hard to see on the camera with light and etc. Um, but it's got a satin black on there. Um, it's, yeah, it's not too bad. It's seen a lot better than what it was. Down that side there. Um, that's the inside. And on this place here is where I had the paint run, but um, it's gone. Cool. Uh, oh no, it wasn't there. There we go. Bit of a run there, but that doesn't matter. That's that's where it gets hit anyway. That bolts onto the. Hang on. So we've got the front of the mower, motor obviously on there, back of it, and that little side flat just bolts into place there. And there comes the grass. Well, there won't be because I'm not going to put any blades on, but if I were, that's where it'll be. So, um, yeah, not a bad result. As I said, look, it's only going to be a quick video. Um, it's a, something to do, but... Um, um, put that back down there. Right. I don't know if you can see down under there or not. Just have a whole pile of bits and pieces. There's the, the motor and the wheels and the handles and the frame and everything. We, we've got a lot of work to do on this, but as I said before, time's a bit of a thing. Um, I didn't have any of that last week. Um, I, yeah, I didn't think I had much this plan this week, but uh, uh, 
Hang on, I'll explain in a minute. Stick around. Uh, hopefully I've got that set up alright. I haven't got uh, it hooked up or connected to my phone. So, I mean, last time I chopped my head off. Um, probably think you should chop it off about here, but anyway. Uh, okay, now the plan was um, to get a few things done on the old Victor this, uh, this weekend, but um, we've got a little bit of a function on Saturday afternoon um, that uh, the local Speedway, the Bunbury uh, Car Club, uh, found out it's Dad's birthday. Uh, Dad'll be 91, uh, and they missed his 90th. So they're throwing him a 90th birthday on his 91st birthday. Um, and it's a bit of a get together at the club because Dad was um, oh, not fully instrumental, but he was a big part of, of getting the club up and running to uh, uh, to a modern day thing from a, a small country family get together type setup uh, in the early days, in the early 70s, along with a lot of other people. Um, put a lot of time and effort and money into it. Um, so they've organised a little bit of a, uh, a get together for a couple of hours at the club rooms, uh, which I'll be going to with my brother and dad, uh, which is good. And um, so that's uh, that's rule Saturday out. Um, Sunday I might get a bit of time to do this, um, but we're, yeah, as I said, look, we've still got work to do in the house. We've got painting and stuff to do. But anyway, doesn't matter. I'm, I'm rambling. Um, so the plan is sometime on the weekend I'll get some of this more, more of this stuff done whether it's painting or just cleaning um, whatever's going to be easiest we'll see what uh, what time prevails so um, if we get something done great we'll put a video video up if not we won't um, the next video might even be something on the bike because uh, I intend to get the bike out this weekend um, and go for a bit of a ride so um, we'll see what happens and uh, what pans out so Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment and tell your friends, neighbours and pets and whatever people, even if you don't like them, probably people you don't like, just to piss them off, uh, tell them to come watch this stupid old bugger with his videos. So, uh, yeah, whatever. Um, thanks again and uh, we'll catch you next time on Was A Half Triple Eight. Bye for now.